So last April we did a very short video on mixed bloom. At that point in the season we were really happy to have mixed bloom because a lot of the trees hadn't bloomed at all. Uh, that was a consequence of having a mild winter. And so right now we're in the middle of January and we're seeing mixed bloom on many of our trees. Uh, it's not especially good news right now because mixed bloom is usually not as productive as in it doesn't set as much fruit as a pure bloom. We've had a lot of cool weather here, but not a lot of cold weather until very recently. And each variety of mango has like a different requirement for the amount of chill needed to produce a bloom. Uh, it's all about weather and the condition of the plant. Uh, for instance, if you've recently trimmed your tree and it had growth on it that was too young to set fruit, uh, or flower at a certain point in the season, it might be mature enough to bloom uh, later on in the season and it might be mixed bloom at that point. Uh, anyway, here are two examples of mixed bloom. It can happen for potted plants. This happens to be a rosy gold and we have mixed bloom and on all three panicles. This behind me is Venus. Here's a panicle of pure bloom. Actually, there's several right here, different stages. Got a lot of flowers still to emerge on the top of that one. And right next door is mixed bloom. The red leaves, of course, will turn green as they mature, but we have flowers coming out of the same area here, alternating, sometimes even coming out right above a leaf. It looks like these two have this leaf and then flowers emerging. So in this whole area there are far fewer flowers than they are on a regular pure bloom. Chances are you're gonna get more fruit on panicles like this versus panicles like that. In fact you might not get any fruit at all from these flowers. So here's another instance of mixed bloom. This happens to be Ugly Betty. It's looking gorgeous. And what's interesting is, well, there are a couple things, but one of the things that's interesting is we have a whole lot of pure bloom in this area of the tree. We have some mixed bloom in, the, in this general area pure bloom on the other side and we have very new bloom that appears to be pure bloom down here. So three stages of bloom. It looks like the older bloom is pure, the uh, next bloom is mixed, and then the newest bloom is pure again. So it's a combination of the timing of the weather and the particular branches of the tree. So I want to show you a couple things that are interesting to me. Of course, this is the beautiful pure bloom. This is a typical mixed bloom here. And this is something different. This particular panicle is almost pure bloom. It has two leaves on it. And then this little shoot is all leaves. This has happened a little bit differently here, which this is almost all foliar growth. And right down here, we have an emerging flower and a couple of emerging flowers, possibly, I don't know if they'll develop, up the stem. So, two kinds of mixed bloom. We have mixed bloom on the panicle itself, and then also uh, leaves emerging from the same area 
as bloom is emerging. So remember, mixed bloom is completely normal considering the weather that we've had. Uh, we've gone from bathing suit weather to get out your winter jacket weather, sometimes in the same day, uh, but it's been warm in general. So a lot of trees do not have their pure bloom, but we still have a lot of time left in the mango flowering season. So if your tree hasn't flowered yet or hasn't flowered strongly yet, there's still a lot of hope for having a lot of flowers and hopefully a lot of fruit for 2019. Thank you.